The last official weekend of winter was a celebration for people in and around Rostern. The annual winter festival kicked off with a pancake breakfast at the Jubilee Sports Center. The U15 Girls Valley Vipers softball team served up both the pancake breakfast and a Ukrainian supper for the two-person bonspiel. This is the main fundraiser for the team and the support of the community means a great deal to everyone. Although the wind reminded all that winter was not finished yet, the weather enticed the young and old to come out for the afternoon's activities. During the morning, the arena rang with the sounds of the up-and-coming hockey kids as they participated in the Future Stars Hockey Skills competition before the ice was turned over to the shinny players from 12 to 3 p.m. Activities on the skating ice wrapped up with glow skating from 3 to 5 p.m. In the lobby of the arena, kids could have their faces painted, color pictures, and even try their skill at plate spinning and different circus manipulation tricks. Outdoors a bonfire offered the opportunity to make s'mores and enjoy some hot chocolate. The Rostern Agricultural Society partnered with the town to bring horse-drawn wagon rides to the festival. Funding through the Sask Lottery's Community Grant Program for Sport, Culture and Recreation helped the town to host the festival free of charge for participants, aside from the fundraising funspiel. Community sponsors for the festival included local businesses as well as provincial crown corporations Sasktel and Sask Energy. Sask Lotteries is celebrating 50 years as the main fundraiser for more than 12,000 sport, culture, and recreation groups in communities across Saskatchewan. Proceeds from the sale of every lottery product purchased through Sask Lotteries positively impact sport, culture, and recreation groups across the province. These groups support a wide range of activities and promote opportunities for people of all ages and abilities to play, create, and grow. To help fundraise against the rising costs of amateur sport, Sask Sport, which was incorporated in 1972 and volunteer-led, wanted to run a lottery. To be granted the lottery license in the province by the government of Saskatchewan, founding volunteers Cass Pelik and Joe Carnuka agreed to sign a promissory note to help start a lottery fundraising program. The tickets for that first lottery called Saskatchewan Sweetstakes began being sold on September 1, 1973, for a draw to be held on January 3, 1974. The Sweet Stakes tickets sold for $1 a ticket and provided a chance of winning cash prizes totaling $100,000. The Saskatchewan Sweet Stakes Lottery was a success and resulted in a total of $197,443 being raised which was then split between sport, culture, and recreation groups. During this time, the Saskatchewan government finalized a deal with Alberta, Manitoba, and British Columbia to form the Western Canada Lottery Foundation, now called the Western Canada Lottery Corporation.